Let's travel to the West Coast. It's the Rangers and Canucks. Vancouver beat New York on November 8th. It was the Rangers' only loss in their last eight games. Yes, they've been red hot. First period, Canucks power play. Troy Stetcher with the point blast. Eric Stepan lays out to block the shot like a good hockey player. He's feeling that one. Struggles to get to the bench, but he stays in the game. Late in the first, Mats Zuccarello finds JT Miller the redirection past Jacob Markstrom. It's Miller's sixth of the season. Makes it one nothing for the Broadway Blue Shirts after one to the second period. New York on the rush. Kevin Hayes steps into one. Blasts one short side on Markstrom. It's Hayes' 12th point in nine games. It's two nothing Rangers late in the second. Now three nothing Hayes also sacrificing the body, blocks the point shot off the top of his foot. The Rangers doing a lot of that in this one. They had 21 block shots, but the Rangers can't block them all. Brandon Sutter throws it on net and it gets past Henrik Lundqvist with Henrik Sedin providing the screen. That's some sweet on sweet violence right there. Canucks down 3-1 after two. A buck 49 into the third off the Canucks turnover. Hayes sent in all alone. He deeks to the forehand and scores a beauty. His first career multi-goal game makes it 4-1 and it gets a little worse. Late in the third, now 5-2. Nick Holden cross a speed to Zuccarello. He beats Markstrom. Zuccarello with the three-point game. Yes, a lot of those faces in Vancouver these days. The Rangers win big 7-2. The Rangers sweep through Calgary, Edmonton, and Vancouver on the same road trip for just the second time since 1981. Meanwhile, Vancouver lose at home for the fourth time in their last five games.